Ron, the love for Solo was palpable in that room. Um, I'm just curious what that felt like and also what it felt like to kind of return home to work with ILM again when you worked on Solo. Well, uh, re returning with ILM was, of course, great. Where, you know, Rob right out was fantastic. And, but, but, but then I, I, you know, I, I have a lot of confidence in uh, you know, any relationship with ILM. Um, and also with, with special effects, although it was exciting to see that uh, you know, some, of the, some of the breakthrough uh, ideas in, in sort of technology were beginning to present themselves. Yeah, they started on solo. Yeah, and they did start yeah. on solo. And, and so that was, that was fun to see and, and, and to apply and, and, um, and be a, a, a part of. Um, also, it was a, you know, for me, coming in when I did, it, everything was suddenly a, you know, a very tight schedule. And I was beginning to approve pre-designed effect shots as finals, uh, even while we were shooting. And so I, there was a lot of trust there. It's just great to have that trust and that, uh, and that collaboration. And as far as the, the sort of love for uh, for solo, of course, it's incredibly gratifying, and it means uh, you know a lot to the cast. A uh, great young cast who put their heart and soul into the movie, and uh, and so it, you know it means the world that somehow. It, the, the, the film uh, resonates with Star Wars fans. That's you know, and that's uh, that, that's all everybody hopes for. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>